Ladies and gentlemen, Thanksgiving, the way it's supposed to be. Or maybe not. Let me just say this. This is clearly a... Uh, I'm Bill Johnson. Okay. Around here, they just call me Dad. <laughs> Around here, they call me <laughs> Asshole. <laughs> Around here, they just call me Dad. <laughs> Around the brothel, they call me Daddy. <laughs> Sugar Daddy. Around the strip club, they call me Mr. Sugar Pants. <laughs> Let me say this. I think that's a hymn from a Christian Bible that's being sung at the beginning Probably. of this. So, you know... Uh, separating church and state clearly wasn't a thing back no. then. <laughs> I've been trying to read, but I just can't seem to do it. <laughs> I've been trying to read, but they never tell me how. <laughs> I can't do <laughs> What in the world? Is, this script is awful already. <laughs> Either that or Bill Johnson doesn't know how to act. <laughs> I've been trying to read, and I just can't do it. <laughs> I'm drunk. Try as my might. <laughs> The words going all around the yeah, You know, they ended Prohibition about seven years ago, and <laughs> now I like to get drunk and make fun of the children. Thanksgiving Day. We Johnsons had a good Thanksgiving, the best we've ever had. And I can't help thinking that what made it better was a feeling, a real feeling of thank. Cocaine. A real right. feeling of ecstasy. It's that feeling. When you first snort it. Yeah, I can't help but feeling <laughs> Thanksgiving Day. Why did everyone talk like that back then? Thanksgiving right. Day. Yeah, because this was not the way people were actually talking in real life. No, of course not. They talk just like we do. Thankfulness. And that's odd, too, when you consider the shape things were in when I got home from work yesterday. The floor was a mess. The wife hadn't put away the dishes, and I had to get around hitting on everybody. <laughs> <laughs> the shape thing we're in yesterday. Yeah. Yeah. What? what? But you think, like, when they make the scripts, they would, like, they would write in the tone and texture of what's going on in the day. Nope. <laughs> I guess we'll never really know. There was no reality TV back then, there so it's hard to tell. <laughs> yeah. Mike. Hey, by the way, now we're traveling back to yesterday. So oh, okay. It's kind of a transition of travel back to yesterday. My kids, Dick and Tommy and Susan, were all home from school. And, of course, Mother and the baby were there. Can't remember the baby's name. Mother and the baby. <laughs> we actually don't name children until they're three years I old. <laughs> is, the, is Mother the wife? Mother too? is the wife, oh, and that is no. the creepiest, craziest. It really is. Most, mother. Yeah, that's such a chauvinist thing yeah. to say. <laughs> mother! <laughs> Mother, get over here and give Bill Johnson a little love on his Johnson. You know what I mean? Uh, I'm Bill Johnson, and this is my Bill Johnson. Mother and the baby. Mother and the baby. And I don't remember her name, but who gives a shit? I don't remember either one of their names. She may not survive the coal mine, so better not name her until she can walk. (laughs) His kids will. Mine were living tomorrow, right along with today, looking forward to Thanksgiving. And like most men, I'm glad it was Mother instead of me who had to break the news to them. Children, daddy's left us again. <laughs> Break what news? Children, daddy's left us for the prostitute again. He won't be here for Thanksgiving. But he wanted me to give you these chores to do around the house while he's gone. It's a mess around here. It's a mess around here. Let's travel back to yesterday. Tomorrow's Thanksgiving. Mmm, turkey and dressing and pie and cake. And Daddy's stripper's gonna come over and show me her boobs. <laughs> and cocaine and ecstasy and hashish. <laughs> That's something to give thanks for. By the way, no one knew it was Thanksgiving until they checked the newspaper. What no. you don't see here is that they're reading the newspaper together, like the three kids. Oh, and oh, oh look. it's Thanksgiving tomorrow. Oh, look. Oh, look. <laughs> Howdy do. And fruit salad and whipped cream and cranberries. Gee. I can hardly wait. Me too. Well, you know, children, we've had a lot of expenses this month, and, well, your father and I thought that... We've had a lot of gambling going on We're on the behalf of your father. We're having spam. <laughs> <laughs> no your, turkey. Your father and I thought that we would eat the turkey, and you children can go out and play in the yard. <laughs> eat those berries. Yeah. They're it'll, on bush. It'll still be Thanksgiving. You'll just be a lot more hungry than you were last year. <laughs> Now run along and whatever your name is and shut up. (laughs) Well, the truth of the matter is, there just won't be any turkey this year. No turkey for Thanksgiving? Oh, I'm going to make a pumpkin pie. We'll have plenty to eat, but, well, we'll just have to get along without turkey. Mom, you don't mean it. It won't be Thanksgiving at all. Even the pilgrims had a feast. After all, isn't that what Thanksgiving's for? Oh, Ugh. that's sad. 
like, yeah, that's kind of sad. It's like a little tiny Tim I'm going to make a pumpkin pie, but no turkey. I'm going to make a. I'm going to make three <laughs> pumpkin pies out of real pumpkins. I mean, you can scrape together a little turkey something. Yeah, I mean, you know, isn't there like a screw that the you can go to pie. or something? Yeah, <laughs> tiny Tim. Oh, Happy Thanksgiving, one and all. Isn't that what Thanksgiving is all about? The slaughter of Indians? Oh, Mom. Oh, Where's God. the turkey? Yeah, back then they probably had wild turkeys just running around. You yeah. know, I had wild turkeys last year in my yeah. in my backyard. My parents in, had on them Thanksgiving. Too. Uh-huh. Wild turkeys. They about, kind of, they they, flo- they flock in. Yeah, they flock in. Like three or four of them just kind of jumped the fence. I don't know what they were doing back there, but I thought, oh well, I guess like we could have that turkey. But then I I don't Ow. think. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Your dad went out to kill the first living thing he sees. May not be turkey, but possum is good. <laughs> I brought home dog. That's Sparky, Dad. Well, he's gonna die anyway. <laughs> he's a puppy. I didn't say when he was gonna die. I said he'd eventually die, and now we're going to eat him, and you're going to like it. <laughs> Look at eat, this pumpkin pie yeah. mom made. Mother, eat, mother made. Eat your fruit salad. <laughs> Fruit salad. <laughs> oh, that's so gross. I don't like fruit salad. Uh, well, it's got like a jelly on it or something. Mm-hmm. It's weird. It's like a yeah. spermicide. My great grandmother used to make it. And yeah. Yeah. It reminds me of the KY jelly. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it does. Is that what you guys were using? That's why you had Matias and Mia. Oh. <laughs> it's all coming together. It's all now. coming together. <laughs> we had a little help from KY. <laughs> this episode of the commercial break brought to you by KY. Slide right into Thanksgiving with KY. <laughs> <laughs> gobble, gobble. Yeah. <laughs> Make sure there's no friction at Christmas with KY Jelly. I don't think it's fair. And it was right there that I came in, right in the thick of it. Everyone, shut up! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> your dad's drunk again, and I don't want to hear all your clicker clacking about turkey. <laughs> now, polish my shoes, whatever your name is. <laughs> Daughter number two. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everybody. Hi, Paul. Oh, Mother, Hi. Dick, Susan. Baby. Oh, what's been going <laughs> Baby, unnamed child. <laughs> we didn't name the child because she's my illegitimate daughter from right. my stripper friend. <laughs> you understand how these things work? <laughs> what's going on around here? What's the matter with everybody anyway? Mom says we're not going to have any Thanksgiving. No turkey, no good thing. A fat lot we're going to have to be thankful for. A fat lot we're going to have to be lot. thankful for. What are a bunch of shitheads? Kids are so ungrateful. <laughs> I know. <laughs> There's be thankful pie. you're getting your pumpkin pie and your dad remembers your name. Yeah. <laughs> Those two things. That's right. You should be <laughs> thankful for that. Unbelievable, these children. If these were my children. Kids those days. Kids those days. <laughs> yesterday. <laughs> kids those days. Yesterday. Oh, I don't think you kids really mean that. We do, too. We've always had turkey for Thanksgiving. Yes, and everybody else in the block's going to have it this year, as always. Well, why don't you go to their house? Yeah. <laughs> well, then why don't you call your little friend next door and go on over there. Oh, you don't have a phone? <laughs> you don't have an iPhone to make that phone call? Well, ain't you shit out of luck. Life's tough. Who cares? Yes, we've always had tea, just as a lot of Americans have had it, and we'll keep on having it. Turkey on Thanksgiving is a great American tradition. But what you kids are saying makes it sound as if the turkey is the only thing we had to be thankful for. Well, gee whiz, no, Dad. It's not that at I all. I mean, it is the holiday mascot. Yeah. So. <laughs> I mean, it is one of those things. <laughs> I have not had Thanksgiving on a lot. Uh, there's there, Turkey is not something we always prepare because, frankly, not a lot of people in my family like turkey. We just don't think it's like it's not our okay, thing necessarily. Not your thing. Right. So we'll switch it up every year and occasionally we'll have turkey. But most of the time it's something else. Right. So shut up. No cares what you have to think, Billy and Bobby and daughter number three. Oh, I know, Dick. With turkey, it's easy to lose sight of what Thanksgiving really means. I know how to sexy turkey looks to you, Dick. <laughs> I was a teenage boy once, too. That breast, <laughs> yeah. those legs. What do you think they got the term stuffing? Glistening. Ah, uh, the glistening the butter. glistening breast. Oh, you were touching my hand there. <laughs> <laughs> I felt a moment. There was a moment of electricity between you and I. <laughs> For a second, I thought you were the turkey. <laughs> I've always wanted that turkey to come to life and just give me a squeeze. <laughs> That's like that Seinfeld. Yeah, I know. All right. All right. All right, Dick. Go stuff the turkey. You're mm. old enough now. Don't think we're just making excuses because we don't have any turkey this year. We, well, we know it'll mean a lot more to us the next time we do have it. Well, sure. 
Suppose we don't have a bang-up feast. We're still a lot better off than the pilgrims. That's it, Dick. Uh, do you other kids see what Dick's trying to say? I don't understand. <laughs> oh. Hey, Dad, Dick's an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think Dick's my real brother. <laughs> he just showed up here last Thursday. <laughs> Who is this Dick guy? Oh, I don't know either. Shut up and stop asking questions. <laughs> Mother, who's this dick character? Mother? Well, I don't know. I thought he was yours. <laughs> turkey or no turkey, we've still got all the freedoms and privileges the pilgrims gave us. Ah, there you go. Now you're a patriot. Nice. And out of those privileges have come a lot of things. Things the pilgrims never even dreamed of. Why, we could make a list a mile long. Why don't we do it? But now, hold on a minute. Now, hold on a minute. A lot miles a long way, and I don't want to have to walk. <laughs> We can make a list a mile long. What are the things they were probably thankful for? Let's just take a <clears> guess <throat> before we get into it. Uh, uh, hair gel. Paper. <laughs> a pomade. Pomade. Made their yeah. hair go up yeah. like that. Uh, uh, the horse and carriage. Maybe a bicycle. I think. <laughs> the horse and carriage. Is bicycles in 1947? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm sure there was. Yeah, they were back yes, in the 1800s. Yes. You know those French guys who rode the ones with the big front wheel? Yes, I <laughs> love those. See, yeah, you see them on wallpaper occasionally in a bathroom at a Taco Bell. <laughs> you know what I'm talking yes, about. Yes, I do. <laughs> You've got the idea, but it isn't something you can write down like, well, like a grocery list. You've got to feel it down deep before you can really be thankful for anything. i tell you what let's do. And let's take a little more time to think this over. When you get right down to it, there are some pretty tough decisions in making up your mind what means the most to you. Your life? Sure. That's one thing you can't... <laughs> your life? What in the world <laughs> happened there? Dang. You've got some really tough decisions to make when thinking about being grateful. I if you don't make the right one, I'm going to murder you right there. <laughs> your yeah. life? Sure. Life? Sure, that's an easy one. Well, what about your sister and your brother? Choose <laughs> wrongly and one of them die. <laughs> it's like, what is he talking about? Why is he getting so worked up? I yeah. can't just say what I'm thankful for. I have to think about it. Yeah. Wow, dads were a lot more strict back then. And get along without. But do you know that there are some places in the world today where you have to get along without just about everything else? Golly, Daddy. I guess I kind of got carried away. <laughs> I guess I scared the shit out of <laughs> yes, you children. Sorry. I'm not going to murder you uh, yet. I'm not going to murder you yet. Don't worry. <laughs> And it'll happen in your sleep. You won't even know. Yeah. I don't want you to think about it, really, <laughs> until night. Be grateful for that. Yeah, be grateful for the fact that your father is only a psychopath late at night. You ever heard of Dexter Kids? Let me sit around. Come sit around the fire. Let me tell you. You ever heard of Jack the Ripper? Let me tell you a little... Uh, a little Thanksgiving tale. Let me tell you a sleepy time story, like your dad likes to do. <laughs> let me scare the shit out of you so you will always listen to what I have to say. But I'll bet you one thing... If we really think over what we have to be thankful for, when we sit down to whatever Mother fixes to eat tomorrow, we'll be one family in America that will really have a Thanksgiving dinner. Whatever slop your mother whatever. puts in front of you. <laughs> whatever no slop clue. your mom puts in front of you. Hopefully you're gonna it's eat it. Yeah, you're going to eat it and you'll <laughs> like it. Meanwhile, I'll be down at the boys club having a steak and a beer. Because you know what I'm thankful for? My car. The ability to get out of here without answering any questions. The ability to have complete freedom without having to answer to anybody like your mother does. 1947 such a great time, isn't it, Chrissy? Oh, great time ah, to be great alive. Great time for a woman. Mm -hmm. That's right. Such freedoms. You get not, only, not only do you get to wash the dishes, but you get to choose which slop you feed your children on Thanksgiving. It's so nice. It's so nice. Privileges are galore. Well, that's how it got started. The Johnsons didn't have any turkey. And the kids, no, I mean everybody, likes to make something special out of a special day. So we fell back on something as old as the pilgrims. The kids seemed pissed. Opium. They didn't seem like they <laughs> Yeah, they didn't seem grateful at all. <laughs> they were like, oh, gee, if we're Golly. not going to have a bang-up dinner, I don't want to be part of this family. <laughs> I'm running away with the circus. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't seem happy about it. Daddy, can I turn on the radio? Because you've just ruined my life. <laughs> what am I going to tell Betty at school when she asks what kind of turkey I had? <laughs> I'm going to have to say none, because my dad's a penny-pinching asshole. <laughs> Toting up the common, ordinary blessings that we had to be thankful for. That night, I'd see Dick there building his model airplane, and Susan just playing. 
Only they weren't just playing. They were mulling things over, thinking big thoughts for such young heads. <laughs> It's Pretty hard cool. to believe all those thoughts fit in those little skulls. Yeah. I thought Scient- there was a blank yeah. in there. Scientists are now telling us your head can literally yeah. explode from thinking too much. <laughs> <laughs> well, how do you know what your kids are thinking about? I can guarantee you when they're playing with that model yeah. airplane, what they're grateful for is not what they're thinking about. I have little children. You know what they think about? <laughs> PJ Masks. That's what they think about. <laughs> Paw Patrol. Yes. <laughs> Get me out of my hell, Chrissy. <laughs> <laughs> I can't stop singing those songs. <sighs> and as for Mother and Tom and baby Janet, and yes, me too, it was as if we had our eyes open baby for the Janet first... Baby Janet got a name! Oh, baby Janet. Baby Janet. <laughs> <laughs> Named after my stripper girlfriend. Little baby Janet. <laughs> Adult Janet. <laughs> I like to call her Mother Janet because it just makes love making a little bit more extra. <laughs> right, Mother you know what I'm and saying? Janet. That's right. I have Mother and then Mother Janet. <laughs> Oh, love making! <laughs> you know the greatest part about love making uh, in my time is Chrissy. What's that? You don't have to sleep in the same bed. Yeah, and deal with all. Beds. That's right. You don't have to deal with all the. I don't know what women have some complicated piece of machinery down there, but it has all makes all kind of noises. It sparks. Yeah, it spews out oil all over the place. <laughs> it's, it's crazy. It's smoke. <laughs> it smokes. You know what I do? I go to the other bedroom, the man's bedroom, <laughs> the nice big bed, and I say, "Mother." Uh, would you like me to replace your straw tomorrow? <laughs> <laughs> but it's Thanksgiving, so I get it. Yeah. You know how it goes. 